is Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting ring to episode four of season two of The Devil is a Part Timer. So let's go ahead and get started. And three, two, one, go. Someone like running, stomping on the stairs. Aww. Let me check my phone. That could have been my stuff. Yeah, it's a it's way too dangerous. Yeah, but something just tells me, you know, Chi is a little hard headed and she's still gonna pop. <laughs> I don't wait. It's really called Sephiroth. Really? <laughs> I mean, are we putting a spoiler to FF7 right there? Like, mm -hmm. uh. That also just reminds me I need to play the remake. You have no choice.
Oh, it was so cute. Could have waited patiently outside. It's only five. With what? Your own life? Why did I say that? Why did I say that? <laughs> yeah. 
and she's precious. She shouldn't be able to die or even go away or be sacrificed. Huh. Oh. Oh, yeah, she definitely didn't like that. <laughs> yeah, but unfortunately... <laughs> I mean, we don't have time to answer that question. <laughs> Bruh, you gotta not do that to the child. So my thing is, is 
Alice, is she gonna be reborn? There, there's unanswered questions! And we're almost done with the episode! Where is she? I mean... That's what happened. And the daughter is dead. Like she just, the child just sacrificed herself. Might be reborn.
Okay. Thank God the child. I'm sorry. I was trying to she's okay. She's okay. It's like, oh, when she said bye-bye, like, my heart felt like it got ripped in two. Like, oh. No, because I, I hate in anime when kids have to sacrifice themselves for the greater good. Oh, excuse me. It's not cool. Like, please stop doing that. Like, <laughs> bruh. And then hearing her voice, like, for a moment, I'm like, uh, like, hold up. Like, are you, <laughs> are you fucking with me? And then no. She's right there. Like, oh my god. Because Amelia. Like, oh. What the fuck is that Amelia went about to suffer? Like, I get that because. Of course, like, you know, in situations and everything, you know, you want someone to truly, you know, grieve over. Because, like, I mean, he got attached to her really quickly. And, I mean, that happens for parents if they want to adopt someone or they have their own child. They get very attached very quickly to the child. And when you fall in love with that child, you will do anything for that child. Like, bruh. I can't even, well, okay, so my dog is my child, so yeah, I know that feeling, I know that feeling very well, um, because if someone did something, my, my dog, ooh, <laughs> you better not let me find out, you better not let me find out. Watch the other wing be, you know, Mao himself. You would end like that. It's like, oh, oof, oof. What, what is with the cliffhangers this week? Oh my god! Like first, not much, and now this. Like seriously, y'all really like it? Like, oh my god, shows really like to take that. It's just, like cliffhanger city. Cliffhangers, I mean, yes, are good. Do not give me wrong. They're great, especially when you have a really good damn episode. And you're like, yeah, this is getting good, and then it just ends, and you're like. You expect me to wait until next week, but <laughs> you already know I have to wait until next week because I'm invested into the show. But does that mean we're going to see Amelia's mom next week? I mean, for episode four, five, 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 um, and such, and learn more on the history and the backstory about this. But like, oof. Still, I, I was, I'm a little surprised that she was going to be making an appearance in this episode today because I was expecting because of the fact is like, oh, hey, she can't be anywhere near this. So I was like, okay, not expecting her to show up today, but to see her at the end was a really nice, pleasant surprise and stuff. And then seeing the reunion of Alice Ramses and, and um, Mao is just sweet because like I said, he is officially in love with her, attached to her as a parent and stuff. And so, of course, like, he wants to protect the shit out of this girl. And I know that feeling and stuff, with, as I said. So, I mean, yeah, like, our little happy families together again. That's all I care about. Like, it's so cute. But we all know, like, this storm is far from over. It's coming back, and it's going to come back with a vengeance. But something tells me we're going to see a little bit of calmness. And then when we get to, like, the halfway point of the series, oh, boom. That's when the big old hurricane's going to come and conflict and, you know, Blood and death and more blood and gore and ish. I don't know. It's <laughs> but other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode four of season two of The Devil's a Part Timer. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad, and of course, I will see you guys officially all on Thursday once I get home from work for episode five. Bye, guys.